In a world of financial confusion, there's only one place you can turn to. Straight Sense News Network. Describe the impact of Lehman Brothers' bankruptcy on small businesses. For your cutting-edge answers. What are some of the challenges that you have in running such a large company? Is there anything being done to prevent the next potential meltdown? From the living room to the boardroom. From Main Street to Wall Street. This is Straight Sense. Hi, everybody. Welcome to Straight Sense. I'm your host, Wayne Soares. We're here today with Larry Lorenz, President and CEO, and Paul Masson, Vice President, Field Operations and Business. Gentlemen, welcome to the program. Wayne, thanks for having us here. Thank you very much. Everyone wants to save the environment, gentlemen, but cost is often prohibitive. Can you tell me how your company and your technology is different? What we have developed is a product that a diesel engine operator can install in his engine. What it does is affect or reduce the amount of black smoke or soot or diesel particulate matter that the engine emits. It's different from most other products in the fact that we go through the air intake system. We're not a fuel additive. We're not a post-combustion device. We're basically there to solve and re reduce the emission output of a diesel engine. And these diesel engines can be from buses all the way up to the large uh, shipping uh, industry with the large marine vessels is where our main focus is right now. Now, gentlemen, are there technical challenges for installing, in, installing this device? Actually, no. It's, we've spent a lot of time developing this device to make it very small and very compact and yet very, very effective. But what it is is it's a platinum catalyst vapor that we develop. That vapor is ingested through the air intake system of the engine. So that vapor is in the cylinder prior to the entry of any fuel, regardless of how much fuel that engine burns. So when all the catalyst does is accelerate the reaction to allow for more fuel to be burned in an individual power stroke at, in, at that given time. You burn more inside, you have less going out to the unburned fuel through the exhaust. Gentlemen, basically what you're saying is that ships using eco-emission system alone can greatly reduce the amount of pollution in, in the air. And it saves fuel too. Yes, you're right, Wayne. Uh, clients have a, an, an incentive to use us because they're saving money and adding dollars to their bottom line. There's several advantages for a, a diesel engine owner uh, and a number of applications. For the, for the engine owner, it can, the advantages will be not only the reduced fuel that Larry mentioned, but also the reduction of the emissions. We can reduce some of the exhaust emissions, the diesel particulate matter, the black smoke, the soot, anywhere from 30 to 40 percent. The uh, NOx, the hydrocarbons, CO2, we're in a 15 to 25 percent range reduction on those because we're taking care of what happens in the cylinder prior. It's a pre-combustion, so we can make things happen prior to combustion. It's also in service on a number of maritime vessels That's as well. Correct. That's correct. We did one um, recent test involving a Seattle tugboat company, and for the amount of fuel they burned, they determined that they saved, in the test results, that they saved over $62,000 a year on fuel on one vessel after all of our costs were subtracted. Right now we have uh, in excess of $140 million worth of uh, product demand. And this is just a result of us exposing the product to the market uh, in, in Pacific Northwest. Talk about a, a little bit about a, a gentleman by the name of Wild Bill. As Wild Bill uh, and as Wartowski, also Captain Laxey Laxfoss. Uh, and they're, they're captains of the, uh, the Kodiak, which is one of the very famous ships on the deadliest catch. We had just installed on their vessel, because they're, they're really watching to measure things to make sure everything was going. And uh, Laxey had sent down a quotation on his Facebook page, page where he blogged, that uh, they couldn't believe the efficiency of the change in the engine. They were saving over six gallons an hour on their main engines alone. It's, it's ironic, and that particular vessel, it can operate up to 3,500 hours a year. And when we did the calculations for both Laxey and Wild Bill, we, we figured out at 3,500 hours a year, at $3 a gallon, they could save in excess of $42,000 worth of fuel expense alone. Plus the other advantage of reduced engine costs, lower maintenance, longer engine life. It is a simple solution that can render some pretty immediate results. Eco emissions technology relative to the carbon credit market, what are the implications there? Because our product, uh, the design of our product, we are measurable. And uh, we can measure the fuel savings and we can measure the, the effectiveness of it. And that's what carbon credits are all about, is, is paying for that difference, the difference you actually save. 
So we're one of the few products out there that we can actually measure it. It not only it, it aids the environment, helps the environment, but it also saves your clients and consumers a lot of money. Yes, the clients are uh, now who operate large companies with large diesel engines are faced with some uh, pretty daunting tasks. What to do? Uh, they're being pressured by the environmental groups to, to do something. They're uh, pressured by the shareholders to basically, what are you doing to go green? And they're always, their biggest fear is whatever you're going to go green, it's going to cost you something. With eco, we're cost negative. And that cost negative means that we actually save you money. You, you gentlemen mentioned farm equipment applications, and I, I would think with the recent growth of organic farming, this would also be very beneficial. Give, give, give us your thoughts on that. We'll be probably addressing that uh, come next spring, and uh, we're focusing on the marine industry first because there's a big, huge need there. So when you talk about, we got excited earlier about the fuel savings that they're having that really make it worthwhile, just add the carbon credits and it, it gives you that real wow factor. I want to thank you, Larry Lorenz, Paul Masson of Eco Emissions Solutions, Inc., for being on the program here. Thank you, Wayne. It's been a pleasure being here. Thank Our pleasure, you. Wayne. Thank you very much. Thank you, gentlemen. You've been watching the Straight Sense News Network. My guests from Eco Emissions Solutions, Inc. have been Larry Lorenz, President and CEO and Vice President Paul Masson. We'll be back with more of our program right after this.